Nationwide protests continued their first Sunday with demonstra demonstrators marching against Islamophobia and a controversial bill that has been criticized for targeting Muslims. Demonstrators took to the streets chanting slogans against Islamophobia under the leadership of the collective Front Against Islamophobia and for Equal Rights for All. The French government has targeted Muslims, even Islam, and is interfering with Islamic practices. This is too much. We condemn the government's colonial, colonialist and neocolonial approach. Omar Salwadi, the organizer of the demonstration, told the Anadola agency. Salawadi said the protests will continue against the so-called separatism bill. Ismail Al-Hajri, one, Al one of the protesters, said we are against all the attacks of the Islamophobic policies carried out by the government for 10 years. This is a bill that restricts freedoms and will result in further discrimination against women with headscarves and Muslim women in general, approved by the National Assembly on February the 16th this year. The or the bill will be debated in the Senate on March the 30th. It's expected to turn to the National Assembly after a vote is held. It was introduced by Macron last year to fight so-called Islamist separatism. The bill is being criticized because it targets the Muslim community and imposes restrictions on almost every aspect of their lives. It provides for intervening in mosques and the associations responsible for the administration as well as controlling the finances of associations and government organizations and NGOs belonging to Muslims. It also restricts the education choices of the Muslim community by preventing families from giving children home education. The bill also prohibits patients from choosing doctors based on gender for religious or other reasons and makes secularism education compulsory for all public officials.